When we think about the Earth's ancient past, we might imagine massive dinosaurs or woolly mammoths, but beneath the waves there are creatures still living today that have seen epochs come and go, silently watching from the depths as the world above has changed. Today we're going on a journey into the deep exploring ten amazing sea creatures that have withstood the test of time and have lived to tell the tale. From the elusive Coelacanth to the mighty Sturgeon, each has its own incredible story of survival against the odds. Starting off at spot 10, cue the dramatic music because the Coelacanth's story is one of intrigue and unexpected twists. These living fossils, as they're aptly named, have been swimming in our oceans for nearly 400 million years. For perspective, that's before the time when plants colonized land, and way before the first dinosaur roared its existence. Yet until 1938, we thought the Coelacanth had been extinct for 65 million years, its memory only living on in the fossil record. Then came a day in December 1938 when Marjorie Courtney Latimer, a museum curator in East London, South Africa, discovered a peculiar blue fin protruding among the usual catch of a local fisherman. An animal believed long extinct was still alive, virtually unchanged from its ancient ancestors. Their unique features such as the hinge in their skull, the lobed fins which move like limbs, and an electroreceptive rostral organ in the snout used for hunting offer a fascinating window into the past and the evolutionary steps that might have led to life as we know it today. Now at spot number 9, moving to the dark, icy depths of our oceans, we encounter a creature that appears to be straight out of a prehistoric book, the Frilled Shark. This deep-sea dweller with its serpentine body and rows upon rows of terrifying teeth is one of the few extant species of sharks from the family Chlamydocelacidae. Its primitive features, like the six pairs of frilled gills from which it derives its name, the three-pointed teeth perfect for snaring squids, fish and other sharks, and a body that can grow up to seven feet long, all contribute to its reputation as a living fossil. Living in depths of 1,500 meters, the frilled shark is a formidable hunter. It's believed to ambush its prey, coiling its body and striking in a manner similar to a snake. Its long, flexible jaw allows it to swallow prey whole, while its specialized teeth prevent escape. This mysterious creature of the deep is truly a relic from our oceanic past, remaining mostly unchanged for millions of years. The horseshoe crab, despite its name, is more closely related to spiders and scorpions than crabs. These hardy creatures have been around for approximately 450 million years, outlasting multiple mass extinction events and remaining relatively unchanged throughout that time. In essence, they're perfect snapshots of a long-lost era. Their distinctive helmet-shaped exoskeletons and long pointed tail might seem otherworldly, but these unique adaptations have served them well across the eons, yet it's their blue blood that makes them a modern-day marvel. Rich in a substance called Limulus amabocyte lysat, LAL, it has the ability to clot around bacteria protecting the horseshoe crab from infection. Today, medical science uses this unique quality to test the sterility of equipment and vaccines, providing an unexpected link between this ancient creature and cutting-edge human health advancements. If you've ever heard of sea serpents, chances are you've been hearing stories passed down through generations about the giant oarfish. Reaching lengths of up to 56 feet, the oarfish is the longest bony fish alive today. However, their long, thin, silver bodies with bright red crests are rarely seen, as they tend to live at depths of around 3,000 feet. The oarfish's lineage can be traced back to at least 245 million years, where their ancestors swam through the same oceans as the dinosaurs. Known for their peculiar method of propulsion, undulating their long dorsal fins while keeping their bodies straight, the behavior has earned them their name. Interestingly, their appearances in shallow water or the shore often incited fear and awe among ancient seafarers. Even today, these elusive deep-sea dwellers continue to captivate us with their ancient lineage and mysterious habits, reminding us of the wonders and mysteries that reside in the depths of our planet's oceans. Now at spot 6, the Nautilus, an ancient sea creature that has roamed the oceans for over 500 million years, has changed very little in that time. The spiral shell of the Nautilus, divided into chambers, is a natural marvel of engineering and has been a subject of fascination since antiquity. As the Nautilus grows, it adds new chambers to its shell, always adhering to a precise and complex logarithmic spiral. These living fossils inhabit the deep slopes of coral reefs in the Pacific and Indian Oceans. The creatures, 
capable of living up to 20 years, spend their days hiding in the depths and come closer to the surface during the night to hunt. The buoyancy of their shells, achieved by controlling the gas and liquid within the chambers, allows them to move up and down the water column with relative ease. Adept survivors, the Nautilus's half-billion-year tenure on Earth is a testament to the efficacy of its unique adaptations. The Greenland shark, one of the Arctic's most mysterious creatures, is among the oldest living vertebrates on Earth. Studies suggest that these icy water dwellers can live for at least 272 years, and possibly up to 500 years. Imagine a creature swimming today that might have been alive when Leonardo da Vinci was painting the Mona Lisa. Greenland sharks are not only remarkable for their age. These predators, growing up to 21 feet long, navigate the freezing Arctic waters with surprising grace. Their favorite prey includes seals and fish, but they're not above scavenging a meal from the carcasses of reindeer or even polar bears that end up in their icy domain. Despite being apex predators, these ancient sharks have low metabolic rates and are known to be sluggish swimmers. Yet, their fascinating lifespan, resilience and adaptation to one of the harshest environments on Earth underscore the incredible evolutionary endurance of these ancient species. When we think about prehistoric creatures, the humble giant clam might not immediately spring to mind. However, these mollusks have been inhabitants of the warm waters of the Indo-Pacific coral reefs for over 20 million years. With their large, colorful, and ornate shells, they are the largest living bivalve mollusks, capable of reaching over 4 feet in length and weighing more than 440 pounds. These extraordinary creatures live in symbiosis with photosynthetic algae, which reside in the clam's tissue. In return for protection and access to sunlight, the algae provide the clam with nutrients. This symbiotic relationship has allowed the giant clam to survive for millions of years. Despite their size, these gentle giants are non-migratory and remain in the same spot once they've settled as juveniles. The giant clam thus is an enduring reminder of the intricate balance and extraordinary longevity that life in the ocean can achieve. Now for our third spot, predating many dinosaurs, the alligator gar is a species that has inhabited North America's freshwater systems for about 100 million years. They get their name from their crocodilian shape, featuring an elongated snout and two rows of sharp teeth in the upper jaw. Known for their armor-like scales, alligator gars can grow up to 10 feet and weigh over 300 pounds, making them one of the largest freshwater fishes in North America. They have a slow growth rate and are known to live several decades. They can even survive in brackish water or endure periods of low oxygen levels by gulping air into their swim bladders, which function similar to lungs. In spite of their fierce appearance, alligator gars are generally not a danger to humans. Their ancient lineage and unique adaptations have seen them through vast changes to the Earth's ecosystems over the millennia. In their continued survival, they reveal how some of the oldest strategies for living are still successful after millions of years. In the deep, mysterious corners of the ocean live creatures virtually unchanged for hundreds of millions of years, one of these is the Nautilus, a creature so old it roamed the seas during the time of the dinosaurs. Distantly related to octopuses and cuttlefish, the Nautilus is the sole surviving genus of the subclass Nautiloidea, with a fossil record stretching back over 500 million years. Nautiluses possess a distinctive feature that makes them unique among cephalopods, a spiral chambered shell. They use the gas-filled chambers of their shells to control buoyancy an ability that's helped them survive through multiple mass extinction events. Inside their shells, Nautiluses lead a mysterious life. They spend most of their time in the deep ocean, coming to shallow waters only to feed and mate. Despite their longevity as a species, Nautiluses are currently under threat due to overfishing and habitat destruction. Their slow reproduction rate and long gestation period make them particularly vulnerable. The story of the Nautilus is a stark reminder that even the most resilient and time-tested of species can struggle to survive in the face of human activity. Last but certainly not least, we have the sturgeon, a group of fish species that are amongst the oldest and longest living vertebrates on the planet, with their distinctive streamlined bodies and rows of bony plates for protection. Sturgeons have existed since the time of the dinosaurs around 200 million years ago. These incredible creatures can live to be over 100 years old, with the oldest recorded sturgeon reportedly reaching an age of 152. Sturgeons can also reach tremendous sizes, with some species growing up to 18 feet long and weighing over 2,000 pounds. 
They're known for their late maturity and infrequent reproduction cycles, which unfortunately make them vulnerable to overfishing. Interestingly, sturgeons are also renowned for producing caviar, highly prized as a luxury food item. However, this has also led to a decrease in their numbers due to overfishing. While sturgeons have survived multiple mass extinctions over the millennia, they now face a serious threat from human activities. Their tale is a stark reminder of the complex challenges that even the most ancient and adaptable creatures face in the modern world. And so, after diving into the world of these ancient mariners, we realize how each creature carries within it a piece of our planet's history, a living testament to the tenacity of life. Their survival serves as both a testament to nature's resilience and a cautionary tale about our responsibility as stewards of this planet and as always, thanks for watching.